Welcome to today's tips and tricks video. I will cover a tip in regards to adding a new member to the active member list. So once you're logged in to your Club Runner website on the admin page, you would click on active member list to add a new member to your member roster. Okay, so you're gonna go in the top right hand corner, you're gonna click on add new member. And all the fields in red are required fields in order to be able to say to save this profile. So let's just say for uh, we're gonna input some information here. So we're gonna put uh, first name John, last name Smith, uh, gender we're gonna put male, uh, membership type he's an active member, date of admission today's date, for address line one we're gonna put uh, one two three, ABC Street, for city. We'll just say Townville, country, Canada, province, let's say Ontario, even though those are not necessarily required for the zip or the postal code. L1L, 1L1. And here at the bottom, we're going to put um, the logging name. And for the logging name, I'm just going to use my name just so I can show you this example. So I'm going to put VLAD, temporary password VLAD. And I'm going to click Add Member, and I should be getting an error message now. Exactly. So login already exists because what happens is that the system recognizes that within the whole Club Runner database, so not just within this Rotary Club, but the whole database, this login name is already taken. So I already have a, a username with this name. So my, what I like to suggest is to use that member's email address as the login name because an email address is more unique to a specific person rather than a nickname or a short form of a, of a name or what have you. So instead of my name we're gonna use an email address let's say um, test123456 at example.com okay so that should now work we're gonna click add member And as you can see, I did not receive the message at the top that the login already exists. And here we have John Smith's profile. All right, thank you very much. I just wanted to show you that and uh, keep that in mind. Um, try and use uh, that person's email address when, uh, when inputting um, a new login name for, for a new member. All right, thank you so much.